Ladies and gentlemen, viewers from around the world and Bahrain, welcome to another episode of We Have a Winner, taking place right here at In Ma Ma. We'll be walking around and giving a lot of giveaways and having a lot of great moments and smiles. All this happening in this show. We have a winner, so let's go. And ladies and gentlemen, I came across another visitor here at the mall. How are you today? Fine, thank you. So, do you want to win? Yeah. Okay, very simple. She's here, you know, calm and gentle, ready to win this competition. I'm going to ask you three questions. You answer two right, and that's it. Okay? Okay. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Do you like ketchup? Yeah. Chinese. Oh, you think it's Chinese? Wow, I didn't even go with a question yet, but pretty much she went with the whole thing. But let me ask you the question. Let me ask you the question. From which language did the word ketchup come from? Apparently you like Chinese food, like, you know, sweet and sour and all of that. But actually it's very interesting that you came up with that word. The word ketchup, is it English, Chinese, or French? Chinese. You sure? Yeah. But, I mean, I mean, you know, we always lived our lives knowing that ketchup is an American word. I mean, you sure it's not American? It's chi Chinese? Chinese. Chinese, yeah. But we always hear the word ketchup in every American movie. So, so it's, not chi it's not American? No, Chinese. You sure? Yeah. But you, okay, if it's Chinese, Chinese. You know, it, apparently you like your sweet and sour and you like your ketchup. So, let's go. It is actually Chinese. You're actually, you're, how do you know this? I don't, I don't know. Like, like how, do, how, do, how do people know this? I, I never knew that was Chinese. I, I never knew that. Okay, well, congratulations. We're gonna go for another question right here. Do you like butterflies? Yes. Okay, I think they're beautiful too. So, but I never had the chance to count their legs. I just see their, you know, their, uh, their wings as they flip it and that's pretty much it. But I'm going to go with the butterflies and see how many legs do you think a butterfly would have? Four, six, or eight? Six. Apparently, you took your time to count their legs. Okay, well, that's a lot of time in your hands. Congratulations. It is six. All right, how about now for another question? Do you want gifts? Yeah. yeah. Okay, well, she got the third one right. Well, congratulations. Here you go. I, that's it? Are you done? <laughs> Apparently not. Okay. How about this? That's it? Thank you. you oh, you're thanking me? For that, I'm going to give you another one. How do you feel? Yeah, thank you. So happy. Oh, you're so happy? I'll make, I'll make you happier. Here you go. How do you feel now? So happy, happy. <laughs> so happy, happy. How, how, much, how about we make you happy, happy, happy? Toys R Us for the kids. I know. How do you feel? You good? Yeah. How about how about we make you happy, 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 and another happy with it? All right. Here we go. Do you want to be happy five times? Yeah. Happy, happy, happy. <laughs> <laughs> These are like five happies right now by In Mall Mall. How about a big happy for you? Four happy. Okay. How about we give you? You know what? I think you you're happy enough with all of this. Congratulations. The woman who actually took her time to count how many legs a butterfly have. Right here, ladies and gentlemen. And ladies and gentlemen, honestly, I could not shy away the fact of how energetic you are. Pretty much standing on the side, I'm like looking what's going on, listening to the questions. And you were really into it. It's like... I was hearing her answers from far away when other people were competing in this. And I'm like, you know what? You need to get on the show. So how are you today? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Thank you for asking. Oh, my very subtle, beautiful voice, if I may say. <laughs> beautiful voice. So uh, what do you do? Do you work? Do you study? Are you, are you a content creator? <laughs> no, no. Uh, no, I'm not. So what do you do? What, what do you study? I study in Hawaii International School. Okay. <laughs> are you like high school level right now or where? It's good. I don't know. You look like a high schooler at this <laughs> point, you know, pretty much. It's like a lot is going on. And I don't know why you, it feels like you are an influencer. You have your own YouTube channel. You don't have one? No, no. 
I don't have never had one before. Would you go for one? Hopefully one day. <laughs> what kind of content you will do? Uh, video games. A gamer, a gamer. What games are you gonna stream? Uh, RPG, RPG. Really? Like what? Final Fantasy, The Witcher? Oh uh, yes. Or uh, Genshin Impact. Genshin Impact. Oh. <laughs> I, I, you can tell, guys, I'm a gamer myself. Oh, you've played Final Fantasy or The Witcher before? I've watched gameplay videos. Kingdom Hearts? No, I haven't. Genshin Impact, you've been playing it for a while. S ever since launch. Okay, it's not about gaming, but, you know, guys, you can't blame me for being excited right now because I'm here with a gamer. You, once you stream, I'll be your first subscriber, okay? Okay. okay. Send me the link. We can. What are what, you going to call your channel so we can promote you right now? Uh, Naila Gameplay. NailaGameplay.gg, let's go. Awesome, <laughs> awesome. I love what's going on here. Well, let me ask you some questions if you don't mind, okay? You good with that? Yes. Yeah. yes. Cool. All right, all right. Let's go with this. Do you play golf? No. Then this question is for you. <laughs> In which country was golf first played? Is it Midgar? Or the world of Final Fantasy VII? Or is it Rafa Ashargi? Or is it Scotland? Uh, I think it's Scotland. Why not Rafa? Personally, I feel like it's a sport more Ajnabian. <laughs> yeah, but the thing is, you know, you've seen some Rafa, they, 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 <laughs> they, 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 they can hold some sticks and they can, True. you know, I mean, especially at the walk. I mean, stuff do happen over there. So I think maybe, maybe you want to reconsider your answer again. It could be Rafa, right? It could be, but I, I'm going to trust my gut when I say Scotland. See, guys, when you're a gamer, pretty much, you get exposed to a lot of cultures. And you know, Bahrain, when it comes to golf, I mean, we do have the Rafa views, come on. We have Rafa views. So, yeah. yeah. But you still think Scotland was the first country that ever golf ever took place at? Honestly, I feel, yeah. I've, I'm trusting my gut. I think it's going to be Scotland. And your guts is telling you the right answer. Congratulations. You see, that's what happens when you're a gamer. You know stuff. Your guts tells you stuff, man. <laughs> All right, that's the first one. Let's go for another question. Do you like ketchup? No. Good, then this question is for you. <laughs> <laughs> From which language did the word ketchup come? Um, French, Chinese, or Portuguese? Chinese? How, why? Um, Sounds funny. No, 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 it sounds funny because <laughs> um, I heard that it came from that area before. Everybody knows this answer for whatever reason. Everybody knows that like, ketchup is a Chinese word. I never knew that before until I actually did this show. I never knew this. Really? Yes, Chinese. <laughs> <laughs> like, really? I, get the, I got the right answer? What? Really? <laughs> Let's go for another one. I feel like you would know this as well. You already won. I just, it's fun talking to you, to a gamer. <laughs> All right, Havana. Okay, Havana. Havana, na, na, na. Here we go. Okay. You like the song? <laughs> okay. It's the capital of what country? Mexico, Cuba, or Brazil? Come on, it's in Cuba. How do you know this? Which Netflix show have you been watching? I've been watching those dating shows because they always have people from that area. They always have people from there. You're absolutely right. You know, not only she's a gamer, she's a pop culture consumer. She's been watching shows that was orienting her and getting her ready to win right here. Congratulations. Thank you. Well, Naila, how about we help you a bit with some gifts? And I'm talking about not only one, but several gifts. You want, you're ready to receive the goodness? I'm ready. <laughs> She's ready. Here we go. Starting with this, it's a voucher. You okay with that? Yes, I'm ready. You're done? Well, if there's more. <laughs> if there's more, why not? Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> That's it? No, okay. <laughs> How about now? Uh, okay, well, then, no, about now. How do you feel now? I feel very happy. Very happy? You want to be happier? Maybe. Let's go. Okay, here you go. And how do you feel right now? I feel even better. How about we give something for your mom right here? <laughs> how do you feel now? I feel great. 
How about we shoot that dopamine up right there? Yeah, we can shoot it all the way up. Make you super happy. Get your serotonin right there with your happy hormones. You want another one? Yes. Then let's go. Here you go. Thank you so much. You happy now? Yes, very happy. Are you ready to stream? Inshallah. Naila Gaming. Oh, you see, that's out of happiness. That's what happens. You lose control, you lose balance of everything and takes place right here. Ladies and gentlemen, do check her out on YouTube. I'm not sure when, but check all the way, you know, from time to time, search Naila Gaming GG. Inshallah. And her first game is going to be? Genshin. Oh. Genshin Impact for the views. That's why people play Genshin Impact. It's either that, PUBG or Among Us, oh, right? Nice. Fortnite too. Is it still on? Yes, it's still very popular. Fortnite is still okay. Well, ladies and gentlemen, you get to young, you get to learn from the young ones right here with Naya. And I'm here again, pretty much with another visitor at the mall, walking by, just very chilled and all of that. And he wanted to join us in the show. I'm like, okay, let's go. What's your name? Abdul Mohsen. Okay, Abdul Mohsen. So, how about this? It seems that with our conversation behind the cameras, you like countries, you like capitals and all of that? Yeah. All right, so let me ask you this. Havana is the capital of what country? Mexico, Cuba, or Switzerland? Cuba. How do you know this? I know. Do you watch a Netflix show that said Cuba? It's Havana's in Cuba by any chance, or a video game maybe? Video game. I know what game he's talking about, but my guys see it on TV. That's for sure. Yes, you're right. You're right. Havana's in Cuba. Cool. Let's go for another one. You ready? Yeah, ready. Do you like sharks? No. Why? Because they are dangerous. Are they? Yeah. Why? Because they eat people. Because they're hungry. That's what they do, right? I mean, but you would eat stuff when you're hungry. What well, sharks do the same? Okay. Okay. He's just like, yeah, man. Just give me the question. <laughs> so, sharks, sharks. How many bones do they have? Yeah, bones. Do they have one, ten, or none? Ten. They have ten bones. Uh, yeah. Sharks have ten bones. Yeah. That big thing that swims in the sea only has 10 bones? It's so flexible. No. That was not even an option. That's what, not even an option. Either none, one, or 10. 10. Look, let me just level with you here. Sharks are very flexible. When they swim, they swim with big, big muscles, right? And they go fast. So are you sure it's 10? No. Then what is it? Two. Okay. And you are incorrect. It is none. It's zero. Okay? Okay. Let's go for another question. This time we're going to get it right. Don't worry, man. I, I believe in you. I believe in you. I believe in you. Okay. Let's go for capitals again. You ready? I'm ready. You sure? Sure. All right. Sao Paulo is in which country? Is it Brazil, Philippines, or Bahrain? Uh, Sao Paulo. Paulo. Philippines. Philippines? Yeah. Not Brazil or Bahrain? No. Are you sure? Philippines. Sao Paulo is in the Philippines? Yeah. L last time I checked, um, are you sure? Yes. You, you really sure? This could be your last chance, man. We don't want you to walk away without the gaps. I'm telling you. Sao Paulo. Brazil? Philippines or Bahrain? Brazil. What made you change your mind? Hmm? So it's Brazil? Yes. Not the Philippines? No. You sure? Yes. Last answer. It's Brazil. Yeah. Sao Paulo. Yeah. Do you want to go to Brazil? No. 
You don't want to go to Brazil? No. Why? I want to go to America. Uh, the kids got dreams, man. They want to go to the States, sure. Well, c congratulations. Sao Paulo is in Brazil. How do you feel? Good. Good. You ready for the gifts? Yes. Let's go. Starting with the first one. Thank you very much. Good. That's it? Yeah. You don't want more? I want more. You want more? Okay, here we go. Ooh, look at that, man. How do you feel now? Not good. <laughs> Not good. All right, here we go. How do you feel now? No. Okay, okay. Today's world, ladies and gentlemen, when we have kids that just want more and more and more. But sometimes, maybe you want less, 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 right? So that is that enough? No. Oh, God. Okay. Here we go. How about, how do you feel now? No. Oh, ooh. How about now? No, more. Do you want more? Okay. How did... You want more? Yes. That's what happens when you sit down on the dinner table. You just they keep giving you food. Say, hey, I want more. I want more. Yes. Okay. Hey. Hi. How do you know? We don't want more. No. Because I don't have more to give actually. No more. Hey. All right, ladies and gentlemen, the kid who likes his capitals, who wants to go to America, who thought for a second that Sao Paulo was in the Philippines. But God saved him the last moment, right here, ladies and gentlemen, with Abdul Mahsan. And ladies and gentlemen, this is it for today's episode. A lot of smiles, a lot of giveaways, all big shout out and thanks to Inmont Mall for the amazing experience taking place in our show. We have a winner. We'll see you next time in another episode with this show on Bahrain International TV.